all I'm going to do is stick them on top of each other to make a... S Hi everyone, it's me, Tilly, and today I'm going to teach you how to make some safe and easy homemade Play-Doh. Let's go discover what we can find inside. So, to make my safe and easy homemade Play-Doh, you'll need two cups of plain flour, one cup of salt, a tablespoon of oil, whoopsie daisy, and a cup of water with some drops of food colouring. Today I'm going to make red Play-Doh. So, we're going to add our dry ingredients together first. So that is the flour and the salt. Just like that. And give them a mix together. Just like that. So we'll add our wet ingredients into this bowl here. There is our cup of water with some food colouring. And now for our tablespoon of oil. There we go. Just like that. Me. A little bit messy, but that's okay. Give that a stir in. And now we need to combine the wet bowl into the dry bowl a little bit at a time. Let's mix it together. More. Whoa. Add some more. Keep mixing it all up until all the ingredients have combined together. Nearly all together. Oh quite tough but it's going to be so worth it oh so it's a little bit sticky which means too much water in it so i can add a little more flour to stop it being sticky and to make it the perfect consistency Keep kneading it. Okay, it's still a little bit sticky, but I'm going to I'm going to knead it really, really hard. So it all combines. Just like so. If it's too dry, you add more water, and if it's too wet, you add more flour. Well, there is the perfect homemade Play-Doh. Oh, what can we make with this Play-Doh? I know. Roll it out. You better guess what I'm making. I'm making something similar to what I've made before with our Play-Doh here. It's a hot dog! I'm going to make another hot dog to go with it. So just roll out the sausage. And then we flatten this down into a little circle. Just like so. So I've made two hot dogs. Hmm, what else could I make? Oh, I know. Let's roll this bit big. Roll this sausage out here. Into a 
a cool. I have made a donut! <laughs> and one more thing. Oh, I think we can make quite a bit out of this play doh. It's made so much. Bump here. Flatten it out. Oh! Give it a bit of a roll at the sides. Because we've been kneading this dough, I have made a pizza. Let's sprinkle on some cheese. And some toppings. Yay! So I have made two hot dogs, a donut, and a pizza. There's so much more left to go. I oh, know one more thing. Make something really big. Roll it into a ball have a guess to see what i'm making at home and if you make anything cool with the homemade play-doh at home make sure you send me a picture so that i can see how cool and creative you all are so i've made three different size balls all i'm gonna do is stick them on top of each other to make a snowman well, boys and girls, I've had so much fun making all of these cool creations with you and teaching you how to make no-cook Play-Doh. But it is now time for me to go. But I've had so much fun and I'll see you all very, very soon. Bye-bye! Thank you so much for watching! If you want to win prizes like this, please make sure you check out all of our social medias for our giveaways. Make sure you tune in every Monday, Wednesday and Friday for brand new 